5.40 in the morning. I just caught a bus to do the Tango Rio crossing. It's supposed to be beautiful and worth it. So here I am starting my trek across the Tango Rio crossing. It is absolutely freezing, so I'm going to keep moving and catch you guys later. I'm not sure, but I believe that might be Mount Doom from Lord of the Rings. Or it might be that one over there. I'm not 100% sure. One of those. So here I am, about 30 minutes into the hike. Beautiful day, warming up a little bit. Got a long ways to go though. So about an hour into my journey, I've reached Soda Park. That was the easy part of the hike. Now, I gotta go way up there. Ved y media. So after climbing up the very well named Devil's Stairway, I am not quite at the top of the mountain, but pretty close. Uh, I have the option, I believe, of climbing that, but it's like a three hour trip, so I'll probably just continue on the main road up another mountain. It's uh, quite a hike, not quite a uh, ground's pretty damn steep. I don't understand why Frodo had a difficult time. Whew. Probably would help if I had hiking boots and not my running shoes. Oh well. What the hell? Was I thinking? Whew. So here I am, above the clouds. You'd think I'd be at the top of the mountain, but I've got another about hour and a half to go. It's already been 40 minutes of climbing. Not not hiking, climbing. So I'm about an hour, hour 15 into the hike up Mount Yarahuku, something like that, aka Mount Doom. Hold a lot of breath, one of the most crazy things I've ever done in my life. As you can see, there are no paths on this mountain. You just reach out to the closest stone towards you and to pull yourself up. And you actually, you basically climb the mountain twice. Cause the second you take a step, all the rocks just fall. So here I am, at the top of Mount Doom. level with me right now in the distance. Yeah. Kind of difficult to see though. Yeah. Wow. Wow. I actually just climbed up a lava flow. It's good. 300, 400 feet deep. So now that I've climbed 
came out and <sighs> took a look at the view. It's time to climb back down. How? Well, they gave us three options. You either go and crab, hands and feet backwards, or you can walk like John Wayne, you know, feet wide apart. Or the third option, the option I'm probably gonna do. Try and walk down, slip, roll down the rest of the way. <sighs> Good luck, Dylan. How oh, I'm getting down the mountain. All right, down there are two little tiny dots, and those are people. I'm still way up the mountain. Well, no, about two-thirds down the mountain, actually. But I thought I'd show you how I'm getting down. Hopefully, it can come out and get, a, get an idea. Ready, go! little more fun than the way up. Alright, so I just finished my climb. Climb back down, that is. It was a good three hours, about two hours to get up. Maybe half an hour, 45 minutes to get down. It's 11.25. My bus is picking me up in about four hours. On the other side of those mountains, I think. I have about six hours of hiking ahead of me. So I guess that means I gotta pick up the pace a little bit. That was a slight detour up the mountain. So after climbing up another mountain, really completely shot. A little bit of pain. As I can go though, I gotta do it. There's my Mount Doom. Supposedly, if you look out that way. is the sea. And on a clear day you can see it. So eight hours, about 20 kilometers later, I'm finally done. I gotta relax, wait for my bus, get back to the hostel. And he's never gonna do it Go in the hospital. <laughs> yeah, never, never again. <laughs>